So hello guys and welcome back to Tibo's vlog. It's another beautiful day here in Norway and a new beautiful day to do your hustle. And today I woke up and had a very good day, uh, feeling energetic today. And you know when you have those days when you're just waking up and everything is just bam, it's good man. You go in and you just, you're just going forward to your target and everything is falling into place with your mood, your energy, your sleep. Everything is perfect this night. This day have been perfect until to now. Right now, I'm sitting here waiting on uh, Molly's Muan, most vlogs, uh, to come up here so we can finish up the music video, post that, make some business manager account for the artists, make the website finished and also make some ads to, to start bo boosting out. Uh, but today, uh, just my tip for you guys today is just to keep on track and, and sort out people in your life that are not good for you, okay? Uh, this can be even your mom, your dad, your father, your brother, your best friend, whatever. You have to cut out the people in your life that are not going to do shit for you. Okay, I'm going to interview uh, the artist I have in my album now, later in uh, some vlogs. And then we're going to take up this topic, okay? Because uh, they had to switch one person in their life to make everything turn around. And that is me and of course the team in P Daddy. But they just needed one person to cut out all the, all the bullshit, all the, all the messages from the parents, the girlfriends, and everything, and just go for the target, uh, go for their dream, and have that one person that, that helped them, and, and cut out all the bullshit. So I had talked about this a little bit earlier in some videos, how important it is to, uh, to keep, or keep in mind the five person you spend the most time with, and uh, this is really, really true, man. And these guys are a perfect example of that because when they got into the team of P Daddy or Lotus Media or like Tebow's click to all of the entrepreneurs in my network, uh, things just clicked for them, guys. And everything for them just worked out and they have grinded, never grinded this hard ever in their life. And that is just because they cut out all the friends that didn't tell them to do this, that asked them to come out and drink, to ask them to go out, play football, uh, game, uh, play some football. And they just cut, cut out all the bullshit. You know, when you have a girlfriend, uh, a girlfriend that you probably maybe always arguing with, you're never uh, agreeing on shit, and a lot of your energy is going to arguing and thinking about your relationship with your girlfriend. Uh, I think you should just, uh, if you have that one girlfriend, you should just drop her, and uh, if she's not on the, on the team and on it and pushing you to do whatever you want and just sending you messages to tell you, can we go home now, can we quit now when you're working, and just trying to drag your intention away from the actual work that is really important, that one girlfriend, uh, is probably not that important and if she's not down on and giving all she can to support you Fuck her man and get the fuck rid of her because this is the guy This is the person in life that really can fuck fuck things up for you It's your parents like your closest family your brother your mom your dad and it's your girlfriend or wife because these guys have a really uh, impact in your decision makings, uh, your decision making in the in the day to day life. And if th these guys are putting negative thoughts and trying to drag you away from your your focus and your mission, you just have to cut them out. Even if it's your girlfriend, your parent, your mom or dad or brother, cut them totally out of your life, man. You have one chance to succeed in this life. And if these guys are not with you on this task and this mission. Fuck them, man. And then you can come back to them later when you are successful. But right now, if you're in a stage where you have to focus, you have to be dedicated, and you don't have to get all of this negativity shit in your mind, cut that fucker out, man. Cut everybody out. Even if your girlfriend is not totally with you on your dream, uh, but uh, like supports you and not trying to drag you down, that is also fucked up, man. Because if she can't support you and do the shit you need her to do, now the Morris is coming, then just cut her out, man. She's not worth it. Not worth it at all. So, yeah, now we're going to see Mo's vlog. Hello, hello. Hello. Hello, Marius. Hello. And how we have Mia. Hello. Hi, hi. Hi. What's up, man? No, just, just arrived. Just arrived? Yeah. I'm just cleaning up a little bit. Yeah, nice. Nice. Have a good day or? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah? 
Very good day. A very good day. Yeah. It's so funny. She gets so shy when I go in the, the store. Camera. In the camera. Yeah. Or they yeah, I'll show you something here. Yeah. Thank you. Do you Did get you embarrassed to get on being okay. camera? Yeah. This is my beautiful girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, right now I'm sitting here with Mo's vlog. As I said, he's been here for like three hours right now. And can you tell us a little bit about what the fuck have you been doing for? Uh, yeah. Um, uh, we've been editing. We've been uh, adding the visuals okay. to the music video, and yeah, just uh, doing the finishes before we're launching at uh, twenty three fifty nine. On YouTube so we'll be having a countdown and just stay tuned it's going to be a banger it's going to you guys are going to be bumping it with your grandmother with your uncle with your sister with your brother <laughs> and at all the parties coming when we get rid of the coronavirus oh my god man and are you thinking can you just tell us just uh, what 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 can you tell us this is your first music video and my channel is all about trying things and just go for it and then just see how it goes and not be afraid to to uh, to uh, to fail. How would this experience been for you? Um, uh, First time experience. No, like basically everything we do, everything I do, huh? we just go grind. We just know that we're going to make it because you learn from the experience. You, yeah, you learn from experience, right? So all knowledge we get, I just come up to this moment where we're just putting everything in the computer and uh, yeah i'm going to share it with everybody because in 2020 it's all about the phone and uh, attention so we're going to get a lot of attention with the corona music video and stay tuned for the back end bit, bits of the business because that's me and p daddy's job and you guys are going to be understanding how crazy this is going to be when we launch our course oh uh, my god it's going to <laughs> Yeah, so yeah, just stay that tuned, guys. It's going to be sick, of course, man. Okay. If you buy that, you can do the same as Mouse and T-Bars. But as, it, as I said, you said you have gained your experience and, and that's why you're nailing this. But how do you think this project has been for you? Do you think you nailed no. it? Do you think it... What, what, what difficulties was it to, to make a music video, um, yeah, get no, the team together and everything? No, basically, for the music video bit, the hard thing was basically to know how to put the setting in because it's not just people going in a restaurant or going to get served food, but here is you gotta hit the lips, you gotta get the energy level up, and yeah, it has. There's a lot of different um, aspects of the video that needs to be perfect. So, yeah, there's a bit more criteria than the other jobs. So this is cool. But you think it's, it's manageable? You think you have the skill set to do to do this? Anything. Oh my God! But I'm 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 very confident in the team and your abilities as well. So. Looking forward to show you guys the, the, the outcome of this video and uh, I think you're going to love it but uh, this is a team effort and uh, this guy is uh, behind the, the, the editing of the video and, and all of the filming. So a big shout out to him and to most vlog and uh, yeah go show him, show him also so love when you see the music video uh, by clicking on the link down below and subscribing and look through all of his vlogs. Okay. Thank you. So guys, now I'm, now I'm sitting here. The, the time is 31.30 30, uh, p.m. Uh, a, sorry, a.m. And uh, we just launched, as you guys saw, the uh, Fuck Corona song. And in 98 minutes, the song have gotten 405 plays and 55 likes. And I think that is uh, pretty pretty damn good to be the first video out in the first hundred minutes but tomorrow when I wake up we're going to put some ad out on Instagram Facebook TikTok, Snapchat uh, to drive traffic back to the uh, YouTube channel and YouTube video so we really can get the video to go and get some traction in the algorithm uh, on YouTube so uh, we really can get this video up and blowing to go viral because as I said, you have to capitalize on this situation and this is one of the ways I'm going to capitalize because I have uh, thought also that it's cheaper to, to do marketing right now because you can think about it. Every restaurant and uh, pretty much every uh, entertainment place to go like bowling and uh, bowling and bowling like bowling or uh, cinema, uh, swimming, uh, swimming parks, so you, you fucking name it, go-kart. You, you can't go to anything because everything is closed down. So why should uh, businesses use money on, on marketing? 
So I think it's very much easier now and cheaper actually to, to do marketing and to get the, to get this uh, video to go viral. So please guys, I leave the link in the description so you can go over there to P Daddy Promotions YouTube channel and watch the video and uh, I hope you do and uh, thank you guys for tuning in today also and uh, as always, do your hustle, make your money and do whatever the fuck you want to do in life man. Peace out.